Okay, so normally I do um, reviews and unboxings for uh, supplements, gym supplements, because um, I use a lot. But I did a bit of a makeup one. So this is from the shop Miss A. It's like super, super cheap makeup. Um, price is too good to be true, so I thought I'd order some stuff. And then I hopped on and I, I didn't get a confirmation email saying that I had ordered anything. And I hopped on and couldn't find. I thought, oh, maybe I haven't placed an order. So I put in another order. So I may have actually ordered the same things. I don't know because I couldn't remember what I'd ordered. Anyway, it's big mental stuff up there. Okay, so I thought I'd add them up and we'll have a look. Lighting's not the best. It is night time. Oh, that goes to the seat. Our two-year-old has had a fever for the last three days and now has a viral rash. So, um, yeah, it hasn't been very good. So, this has actually been sitting here for two days. So, it comes from America and I ordered it. Oh, it was dispatched on the... This one was the 19th of the 3rd. And this one was the 26th of the 3rd. So maybe I'll open the 19th of the 3rd one first. Because so this is the first one I ordered. Right, as I said, I can't remember what I ordered. But luckily, they sent me this. Alright, this doesn't have the... Um, prices on it. Everything's like a dollar, two dollars, three dollars. I think for the whole thing, including shipping, it's about twenty-five dollars, and I've got eleven, eleven things there. All right, so it comes pretty well packed. Um, so yeah, I don't think anything should be broken. So let's have a look. Alright, so the first thing I got was this Wonder Blender. I don't really have a lot of brushes. I mean, I've got a lot of brushes. I don't have a lot of sponges and stuff. And I'm trying, trying, trying to be better at putting on my makeup all the time. I tend to just wear like a BB cream and I really, really like cream blushes. And then I put powder over the top. I have some highlighters and stuff, but I don't have a lot of blushes. I used to, and I don't know what happened. Um, I don't wear a lot of eyeshadows, uh, mainly because it's my job. When I do do my eyes and stuff, people are like, oh, you're dressed up, where are you going? And I'm like, uh, nowhere. Um, but I really like mascara, and I always do my eyebrows. So I've got no makeup on at the moment. Um, as you can see, I don't really have eyebrows. So I got this um, sponge. It's really soft. It smells a little bit, but it's... Not too bad. Um, so I quite like that. That's from AOA. So I, I will do my first thoughts of everything. And then when I've had a chance to use everything, I'll come and do another review. Then I got this Santi Flawless Perfect Finish Foundation. So it's like a dropper. And I got it in creamy beige. Um, so let's have a look. Oh, super, th ooh, super thick, a bit messy, and I can hear a bubble coming, so I'm do a bit of a test. Hey, Bubby, what's she doing? What's she doing? Say hi. Hi, I've been sick. I'm going to go back to bed. Okay, off you go. I was watching Doc McStuffins. So this is, I think it might be a good colour for me. Um, we'll see. It's gone in really, really smoothly. I can't see it on there now. It's quite a powdery finish. All 
right, so I got this blush in coral. As I said, I didn't, um, I don't have a lot of blushes, so I probably went a bit crazy and I'm probably going to walk away with too many. But it comes this little compact, it's got a little mirror, it's got a little rose on there. You right, Bobby? It's quite a pretty, pretty colour. So that could be quite a pretty colour. I really wanted some pinks. Um, so we'll see. And then I got this duo blush. As I said, these are all these were all only a couple of dollars. So I kind of was like, well, if they end up being a bit crap, I won't be mad. Oh, and this little blush, blush came with this little sponge I just saw, so oh. it doesn't really close with it inside. Just. Yeah, I don't think I'll be keeping it in there. Alright, so this is a duo blush. Hang on, baby. It's a bit lighter, a bit lighter than the other one, and then a bronzer. Hmm. Sorry if my swatches look crap. Um, let's see. Ooh, I've got lots of lippies. Got a concealer and a matte powder. Okay, so I think I've got the kids sorted. I have to go duck off and deal with that. Call it training and all. Alright, so this is matte powder. Also comes a little sp a little sponge. Sounds a bit weird. Um, as I said, oh it's very soft. I um Oh, I think that's going to be a good colour. Yeah. Mm. I like that. That's really soft and nice. So these are all by... This is by... It's all different brands I've never heard of. So this and this is the same brand. And I got Nude. I think this was Creamy Natural in that. Never heard of these brands before, but I guess that's why you're only paying a couple dollars. I didn't expect to have heard of any of the brands. All right, then we've got a concealer. I don't tend to wear concealer, um, but I want to start because I've got three kids and I'm tired and I look tired. See, these big bags. Okay, so the concealer is probably a bit light. make it work. In my former life, I used to work for a company that sold makeup and we used to have to do wedding makeovers and stuff so I do know how to put makeup on. I am not so down with this whole highlighter contouring business because that was not part of what we used to do because um, this would have been a good five or six years ago um, but it's okay, I can learn. And look, I'm never going to go out with a full face, hardcore face kind of thing anyway. Um, I work for a church. It's just not, it's not going to happen. But anyway, let's see. Mm, stuck. Okay, so onto the lippies. So this is a lip and cheek stick in... No idea. Uh... Don't know. Can't. Oh. Blush. No. Okay, colour four. So this is the colour. Sorry. No. Anyway. Ooh, that 
that's nice. You see? It's not very... I like that. It's definitely a colour that I will wear... Oh, that smells like vanilla. On my lips and on my cheeks. It's very creamy. It's like a twist bullet. I like that. Okay. All the things that I like, basically, if I really, really like them, I'm going to go and, and buy multiples of them um, for the price that they are, like multiple colours. So if I really like the consistency of that, I'll go and buy more colours. That's what I kind of tend to do. Um, okay, so there's this lippy in Fawn. So this colour. I tend to wear lots of pinks, roses and nudie kind of colours. I do love a red lip. But I don't work in the industry where I can wear a red lip very often. But I do save a good red lip for um, special occasions. Like I wore one to my sister's 40th birthday dinner. Oh, that's pretty. That's that one. Can you see? Mm. Ah, this smells like vanilla too. This is the same brand as this one. Okay. Then I just got a lip kit, a lip care vitamin E thing in strawberry. Always losing them. Kids are always taking them. They're always disappearing. Um... I don't matter how many I have, somehow the kids end up with them and then they never I never see them again. Even when I clean the house from top to bottom, they just disappear. I'm going to hide that one. Then here's another lippy. I'm pretty sure these lipsticks were a dollar, which is why I bought two. So this is in the colour Amiga. And this is vanilla again. This is like a pinkier, pinkier rose colour. So these are definitely all my colours. I do wear lipstick every day. Um, even if I've only got like a little bit of like a BB cream and mascara and my eyebrows done and a little bit of blush. If I've just, that's like a basic face for me. Like no powder or anything. I always have lippy and I apply it multiple times a day. And then I got this Bold Eye Mascara. Don't know if I'm a little bit concerned that it wasn't sealed. And there's mascara on the outside. Um, like the sticker down here wasn't over the end. That's the brush. I don't want to touch it, but it's very flexible. And this is a waterproof one in the same brand as where did i see that brand as these these all right so that's the first the first little lot that i got so i kind of got a bit of everything i didn't get eyebrows why did i not get eyebrows so i've got the foundation I've got the powder got concealer I've got the blushes so in pinks and in the um, bronzers and a sponge mascara some lippies and the lip and cheek so this is the kind of thing I'd put underneath then put the powder and then put a powder um, blush on top so kind of a bit of a full face going on there so I'm wondering if I should split the videos this is running at 13 minutes Ah, oh, stuff it. All right. It's just going to take like 60,000 hours to upload. And I really only do these things for me anyway. And any mums out there that are interested in cheap makeup and what they're about. Um, you know, I'm not one of those YouTubers that uploads everything every week and wants to make a clear out of anything. This is just for people's interest on an honest review from a mum who runs off a budget. Um, and as I said, I have only done a few videos before, but always on um, pre-workouts and vitamin sups and stuff because I go to the gym five days a week and currently lost 17 kilos and on my way to losing some more. So yeah, fitness is kind of my thing, not makeup so much. Anyway, can be both. All right. I have a feeling <laughs> I've ordered this. Similar, I've ordered two of some things. Eek. 
Right, this is probably a mistake trying to get it all out, but it's kind of all packed. All right, let's see. Let me just move all the other stuff I bought out of the way. And after this, I'm going to procrastinate studying. And I am going to go and do a major makeup, clean out, whatever. Okay. So, let's see what I got in this one. I think I've got the same blush, maybe in a different color. The rest looks a bit different. Okay. Oh, no. Okay. All right. Look familiar? Did I even buy the same? I bought the same color. This is only two or three dollars, so you know what? I ain't mad. It's fine. I'm gonna get myself to blame anyway, so I won't open that one. We'll keep that sealed, and hopefully it's really good. And I'll power through it. All right. So then we've got this blush. How cute is that? Yeah, I think I'm gonna be crazy with the blushes this is in rose super pink I remember this was about a dollar or two dollars wasn't much and it came with like all these different colors so it's tempting to just like get them all oh look how much all that stuff's rubbed off already anyway oh hello that's pink if you can't see it it's pretty pink it's okay I'm gonna make it work oh Obviously, I was feeling like I was really short of the blushes when I looked at this order. And the trouble is I do them late at night after I've had a day where I haven't had the makeup or I've thought, oh, I really need to get that. Or I've watched a review of something on YouTube. Anyway, so I got Gypsy and I got more Mauve. I'm pretty sure these were like a dollar or two dollars. So really, if they're not going to be great, I'm not too upset. Oh, there's that one. I put heaps on. So it's fine. And then, oh, this is like a purple. This is more purpley than I thought, even though it says mauve. But coming into winter, I think these are going to be really good. Obviously, they're really pigmented. I'm not going to need to put on as much as what I'm putting on with my finger. I'm happy with those. And as I said, for the price, they're not great. I don't feel like I've kind of been ripped off. All right, so we've got this blush. Look familiar again. Is this the same color? Um, I, I think so. No, it's a little bit darker. Yeah, you can see it's a bit darker. I'm not going to open that and swatch it because I'm going to keep that one closed. This is so similar. I'll wait till I've um, used the other ones um, before I open it um, just to save myself a little bit. Oh, and look, this is what happens when you cannot remember what you've ordered. Are all the same color? Yep, once again, won't open this one. See, I'm set, man embarrassing but I can't remember what I ordered it was like but the thing is I ordered them and two weeks later I was like maybe I didn't order that and I think I went and looked at my PayPal and it didn't say anything about the company and I was like mm, I'd ordered a couple stuff so I was like oh maybe I just didn't put it through the checkout so I ordered stuff again um, so yeah anyway Whatever, I think one order was like 25 and one's 27. So as you can tell, I've got heaps for that price. Then I've got this bronze highlighter. I'm not sure what I was thinking in regards to getting something that is this shimmery. But anyway, this is pretty. This is really pretty. I think, you know what happened? I ordered a lot of this. I ordered these and I ordered that. So these are all bronzers. When I'd gotten my first spray tan a few weeks ago from this lovely young lady at church. She's doing a course. And I looked epic with a spray tan. I looked, yeah, it sold me. Um, really sold me. And so I was like really struggling to look bronzed with the makeup that I had. I had these, this old bronzer. 
which I kind of managed until it kind of wore off. So I think I was like, yeah, I'm going to get a spray tan all the time. I'm going to look so awesome all the time. I need some bronzer. Anyway, then I realized I ain't got time for that. It's okay. I will make time. Okay, so I got these because I've had something similar from the body shop like this before. I think these were about four or five dollars and you can use them like swirled like this as a like bronzer you see or you can just use one color as like an eyeshadow shimmer um, and so that's why I got them because they reminded me of that and they're really useful and really versatile um, so yeah I'll get a lot of use out of that then I got this UHD Primer Spray. So this is a soothing primer spray to absorb oil, minimize pores, and create a smooth canvas for makeup application. All right. Get into it. I don't have anything on my face because I just re had my hair done and did a face mask. So, hang on, let's see. Mm. This is nice. Mm. Smells nice, really fresh. Feels nice. I like that. If that was only a couple of dollars, which it probably was, in all honesty, we buy more of that. Okay. Now, obviously, I want a little cray cray. All right, I've got another lip balm really surprises me is I didn't get any eyebrow stuff with any of this. I think maybe a lot of the colours were sold out that I wanted maybe. I actually do need some more eyebrow stuff. I don't know what I was thinking. Oh, that smells so good. I have to put some on. That's how good it smells. It's rose hip. Honey. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, I like these. I'm going to open up all these lips and swatch them. Then you can see them and deal with that. Okay, so these two are mascaras as well. So obviously I ordered three black mascaras. But that's okay because I'm really picky with mascara. Um, so hopefully one of them is okay. This is what this brush looks like. Quite a standard brush and then this one how cute is this oh, so cute and then that's a bit of a shorter brush now these are the lippies that I got so this is an LA colors which I've had before and I quite liked in terms of their cheek colors and stuff um, I had a foundation from them and it was just like I was putting water on my face um, so this is the colour, don't know, let's kiss, ooh, which my husband gets home, and that's that colour there, then this one is a Sante, Sante, whatever brand that is, liquid lipstick, um, it's a matte liquid lipstick. It is quite matte on. You can see, no shine. And then this one here had a massive sticker over it. I couldn't get off. And I thought it was more of a rose, I think, online. And it's a really fuchsia pinch. So I don't know how that will suit me. But anyway, so that's everything that I've got. Um, as I said, I think for both orders it would have come to... About $51. I ordered it over a month ago. It didn't take too long to come. I think I ordered them like two weeks apart and they came at the same time. So anyway, whatever happened there, I don't know. And I'm really surprised I didn't buy anything for my eyes. Eyeshadow I knew I probably wouldn't get because I'm planning on using these. But I also have two really large palettes with lots of different colours that I use um, and as I said, I don't do my eyes that often, but I want to try and do them some more. But that's why I didn't kind of buy any eyeshadows. Um, but I am surprised that, as I said, I didn't buy anything for my eyebrows. So I might actually, um, 
if I like this all this stuff, I'll go and get some stuff for my eyebrows. But I'll hop on in a week or two and I will give you a review of all the products. What I like, what I don't like, what I'll keep using and what it will just sit there until it goes manky and expires. All right, but yeah, that's Miss A. So just pop in um, Miss A when you're looking it up and you should be able to find it. It's super cheap makeup um, and so far I quite like what I've seen.